Hey guys, this is Mac from Mac Mods. Um, I say I'm um, a lot in videos for some reason, but uh, bear with me here. This is my new 26650 prototype hybrid dripper, whatever you want to call it. Had a few video requests, so I'll give a, give a quick uh, rundown. Um, tail cap plunger, tail cap housing, Delrin insulator. Copper tail contact, of course the body. Airflow control ring. Another part of the dripper. O-rings. And of course the uh, the business end. Let's see if I can get it to focus. But um, I guess it's got provisions that you could actually run six coils if you really wanted to. I really don't think that's necessary. But right now I have it set up with 0.3 ohm coils, 28 gauge Canthal. It's all titanium construction. It's, I mean, the, the pins there are stainless steel, stainless steel hardware. Middle three positive post piece there is all titanium. Fully machined copper contact. So uh, let's put this together. Um, silver plated beryllium copper tail spring. So let's put this thing together. And put the autofocus back on. All right. Simple spring, tail cap, insulator, copper contact. tight works nice here's the dripper so body tail cap MNKE 26650 these batteries test excellent I've tested them at 10 amps and they put out about 3,600 milliamp, and that was, you know, that that's over 40 watts of power. So battery in, fully, fully adjustable center post for different height batteries. And I put a little spring there. The spring really doesn't carry any current, but it keeps your adjustment from spinning. No battery rattle. Instant. So now you line this piece up with the coils. And as you can see, through that hole, the coils line up perfectly. Next, an O-ring goes on. These O-rings basically just give some, some resistance to the flow control ring. I originally wasn't going to go with the O-rings, but... I actually made a mistake in machining uh, the aluminum prototype and I made that ring a little bit too small and I thought the O-rings were a nice addition it gave it a little bit of contrast. So basically this is your top cap. Let me show that again because I don't think we got it. So completely threaded. It is basically screwed on snug and now you have adjustable airflow. So wide open, like three and a half millimeter. And basically you can just, any draw that you'd like. Hopefully I uh, make a few and bring them to uh, the interested people. It's one of my titanium drip tips. Large bore. Um, size comparison. 
what do I have that's big? Next to an MVP. Proviring. Fits real nice in your hand. I mean, by no means do I have large hands, but see what happens. Take care, guys.